Don't know you somewhere, but uh, in general, no, I work all over the world. And your face is everywhere, so, uh, so you, you can't hide. You can't go to China and hide. Not really, no. <laughs> that title, The Most Beautiful Woman in the World, what is there to fix? What is there to fix with you? What do you mean a fix? What is there to... Is it just a matter of shaping it up? There's nothing to, to make better, is there? <laughs> no, it's to maintain, you know. It's... Working out is really not something that you get to and then you can say, oh, I don't have a, ever have to work out again, um, because you have to maintain it and always keep on doing it. What's the hardest part to keep in shape? I don't have a problem part where it, it's, it's more like that um, my strength, let's say, with push-ups is not as... as um, uh, as good as, as it should be. So I have a hard time doing push-ups and I have a hard time doing lunges too. So those are the exercises I have to work out, you know, a little bit more. Well, the videotape is called Perfectly Fit. Are you perfectly fit? Yeah, I think so. You are. Are you strong? Strong, like... Physically strong? Physically, yeah. I'm, I'm, sha I'm, I'm in shape. I'm toned. And I'm Body has definition. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> but it, in the video itself, no problem. Well, let me see how strong you are. Okay. That's too strong. Too strong for me. <laughs> in the video, you look perfect. You put, you're in perfect uh, shape. Do you ever sweat when you exercise? Um, actually, I don't. I don't sweat so much. But you know, it's better you to get sweat. Hot. It's better to sweat. It's better to sweat. Yeah. When you were growing up, who did you think was beautiful? For me, Audrey Hepburn was always the most beautiful woman. I, uh, I thought not only because she was a great actress, obviously, but also physically she was so beautiful and she had a great charisma about herself. Did you ever meet her? Yeah, and I finally met her um, a couple of years ago. Yeah. And she was as beautiful in person as she was in yeah, film, wasn't she? Yeah, was she was unbelievable. She was giving a speech, actually, on, a, on, a, on stage, and uh, her charisma and her charm was coming over, and then when I actually met her in person, she was exactly the same, you know, very... Uh, it's just an amazing feeling of something about her that's just beautiful. In your early career, you were compared with Bridget Bardot. Did you think she was beautiful? Yeah, I, th I thought it was a great compliment because I thought she was beautiful. Oh. There was a study here just last week or so um, about Australian girls 8 to 11 going on chronic diets, uh, almost to that anorexic stage. Mm. D does that trouble you, the fact that people like you are models for, these, for our next generation of girls and they see you as so slim and so beautiful? Um, well, you know, it's true that there is, a, you know, there's some girls out there in, in, in my profession that are very skinny and even though ma most of the time it's not really, they're not going on diets, they're just naturally built that way. It's true, it's, it could be, a, you know, a threat for young, young people that, that believe in role models and copy whatever they do. Um, I, I don't think it's a good idea. You shouldn't be copying somebody. You have to, you can get ex inspired by somebody, but you shouldn't copy. You should find your own, you know, your own well-being, your own, the way how you feel the best. And... You are always your own person. You just have to accentuate what's good about you. How much do you think your beauty is, uh, is genetic, is because you're mum and dad, and how much is just hard work? Um, well, the way how I am physically in terms of the, f you know, the way how my, my um, face is, is, or my body is built, of course, that's uh, a basic uh, um, inherit and heritage from my parents, obviously. Um, but um, being fit and being in shape, you know, that's something you really have to work on. Are you a vegetarian? No, I'm not. You eat red meat, do you? I eat very, I, I call it the luxury of, of my diet. Um, once in a while I have red meat if I have a craving for it, um, but I really try to avoid it a lot because I don't think it's healthy. Have you ever smoked? I tried it when I was 16, 17. I thought it was really cool because all my girlfriends smoked and I didn't like it, okay. luckily enough. <laughs> alcohol, drink, do you drink? No, I don't like alcohol so much. I, I only like the sweet things like a port, port wine. Everything else I don't like because it's so bitter, and I like sweet things. Well, what do you do? do what do you do wrong? Do you chocolate? Do you pick chocolate. out chocolate? <laughs> sweet things. Yeah. Do you? Do you, yeah. do you eat a lot? Have you got to watch that? Yeah, I got to watch that because uh, I'm not a, one of those lucky people that can eat whatever they want, and uh, and they always stay the same weight. No, I have to really watch. I can do. I can go for my cravings one day, but the next day I have to watch it. I eat a little bit less. And go and work out. And go and work out. Ma make people feel good. Do you, women, do you get up in the morning and look in the mirror and say, "Yuck." Yeah, that happens. Does it? <laughs> when I travel very much, you know, when I'm jet lagged and I don't get very much hours to sleep and I still have to wake up early in the morning and still have to go long hours, that happens when I look into the mirror and I, and I think to myself, oh my God, I need a good night's sleep. A and do you mind with the calendars? Because you've done calendars for the last five or six years, haven't you? Mm -hmm. Do you mind the fact that around the world there are millions of men's locker rooms and, uh, and factories with your body on them? No, I like it. You like it? <laughs> that they're done for them, so <laughs> I'm happy when they buy them. Do you ever get scruffy? <laughs> What does that mean? It means do you ever look a mess? A mess? Oh, yeah, yeah. I look like a mess this morning. 
<laughs> well, you don't look like a mess tonight. Thank you for talking to me very much indeed. Thanks, very and Enjoy nice. this day. Good luck with the video too. Thanks. All right, well, we'll come back with, uh, with more right after the break.